tin. Oh, <laughs> that, that is very cool. They call it invisible water. What do you think? This one has all the hallmarks of a sideshow stunt. It's entirely possible that this was done with CGI on a green screen. Or even just fishing line with clever lighting. But Jamie's got his own theory. That's not invisible water. That's some kind of a super dense gas. There are all sorts of them out there. We just gotta find out which one. The prime suspect is sulfur hexafluoride. It's five times heavier than air. I promise to show you something really cool as long as you promise not to try it at home, okay? Okay. Now, everyone wants to know why my voice sounds higher when I inhale helium. A simple fact is that helium is six times less dense than air, which means sound waves travel through it much faster, which makes my voice sound much higher. Now, the same effect can be achieved in reverse if I inhale something like sulfur hexafluoride, which is six times denser than air. I inhale some of that, and my voice gets really low, although somehow I'm still funny. It's scientific! <laughs> On that low note, it's time to start the test and flush out this potential viral flim-flam. Now that we've got the gas, I want to replicate exactly what I can see in the video. We've got a fish tank and we've got tons of tin foil. I'm going to try and make a boat that floats on the invisible water. All right. Give me the business end. I can't see anything. We'll have to take the full tank on faith, just because we can't see anything. Now, Adam turns boat builder. All right, replicating the circumstances, you ready? Yep. It's a simple proposition. The boat either floats or it sinks. But Jamie can't see why this won't work. And here's the proof of concept. There you go. So that's where our level is. Right, somewhere right about there. Let's just be clear. This balloon is filled with air. And it drops. Unless it's in this fish tank. Where it floats. Because the fish tank's full of gas that's heavier than air. I just can't get a boat to float in it. As pretty as it does in the video. One after another, these tinfoil titanics are launched, then lost at sea. Though the boys do seem to be dialing in on the boat design. Dude, that is so almost cool. Here's hoping it's last time lucky. Jamie? It worked. They've almost duplicated what they saw on the internet. Now, Jamie has the honor of flooding the boat with invisible water. Yeah, I can see it pouring out, man. That's so cool. Jamie double dips, and that's all it takes to sink the cynicism surrounding this oddly transparent viral video. Oh, it's going down. Oh, down to the bottom of an invisible sea. <laughs> Well, like they say, whatever floats your boat. And uh, in this case, it's sulfur hexafluoride. Because just like a boat on the water, when you put a boat on sulfur hexafluoride, because it's heavier than air, the boat floats.